the Greenleaf Inn kind of you know, really came about because Catherine went to a one of the town meetings, uh, town of Delavan, and the uh, we were looking at someone that was looking for zoning changes, and they wanted to flip their residential property uh, commercial, and uh, we started thinking, well, if now, if, we, if we can't really sell it and get our money out residentially, perhaps we need to look at what can we do commercially. And so we started just toying, you know, with the idea. And as we were driving to work every day, going back and forth a small little motel, uh, we kept seeing no vacancy, no vacancy, no vacancy. And then we decided, well, what do we really want to do and what do we want to present? Because we don't want to just be another hotel. And it came down to really making a statement that we wanted to create uh, a hotel that was a romantic couple's getaway, uh, but really was also a demonstration of sustainability and the fact that you can, you can live in luxury and have wonderful things uh, and still do it sustainably. Our whole concept is for the Greenleaf Inn to be an experience. We want people that when they drive up here from Chicago or from you know, Madison or Milwaukee, so that literally when they drive down the driveway, uh, you feel like the burden of the world is kind of lifted off your shoulders. Uh, starting with the fact that when you go in, uh, online to book your reservation, you pick out what kind of sounds you like, and it might be, uh, you know, water, you know, crash, crashing on a you know, beach, or birds singing, or a gentle, you know, summer rainstorm. And that's part of the experience, so that when people come in, you know, to their room, we want that, you know, gentle sound to come up to, to basically say welcome and, you know, this is a time to relax and be able to get, you know, get away with it. They'll take their, their card for that they used to enter into the hotel room and slide it into a slot and that will energize the entire room. Uh, which means that when they leave their room, they de-energize the whole room. So no TVs being left on. Temperatures, you know, do setback points so that we either are, you know, reducing how cool they have it if they're air conditioning or we reduce the heat that's in the room right then and it will go back when they re-energize it again it all goes right back to the same system the entire uh, rooms of course will be spacious about 550 square feet once again we want to show people that you know we can create net zero to where we're not taking any more energy than what we're putting back into the you know into the the system but still really en enjoy yourself and that kind of launched the entire concept of the Greenleaf Inn. Uh, we've gone through a number of different changes and renditions and we're still working on some some budgeting items uh, but we went through zoning in fact uh, we had to battle quite hard uh, on the zoning standpoint to get uh, an allowance for putting up a wind turbine which we proudly have in the, in the back of our yard right now a 50 kW uh, down, downwind uh, endurance wind turbine on a 120 foot monopole and our, our whole concept was we want to show people the different technologies, the different green products that are available and the systems. We wanted it to be an educational uh, you know, tool for schools to be able to use and builders to be able to use and customers. You know, people that are thinking of building and, and really what's available and, and how do the numbers work. And you know, here we are today you know, finishing up our, our plans and hoping to break ground this summer.